This is the second demo in the series of six demos about reclaiming repositories in Oracle VM. This demo shows how to delete and release an NFS repository. The steps in this demo also apply for LUN-based repositories. You can delete the repository that is owned by your Oracle VM manager or that is unowned. When you delete a repository that is unowned, it deletes the reference for the repository in the manager's database, but it does not delete the file system for the repository. Before deleting the repository that you created in the previous task, let's add a virtual disk to the repository. Click the Repositories tab, find your repository, click the Expand button, and highlight Virtual Disk. In the Management pane, click the Create Virtual Disk icon, provide a name and a disk size, and click OK to complete the operation. Because you added a resource to this repository, the repository is no longer empty. Now, attempt to delete the repository. Highlight the repository in the navigation pane and click Delete in the toolbar. Click OK in the confirmation window. The job fails because the repository is not empty. However, you can release the repository, which means that the repository structure and its resources are left intact, but the ownership information is removed. The repository is then available to other Oracle VM environments. To release ownership, highlight the repository and select Edit. In the Edit Repository window, select the Release Ownership box and click OK. The repository is now unowned. You might have to refresh the window in order to see the updated ownership information. Note, however, that you cannot release ownership of a repository if the repository contains resources that are in use by virtual machines in other repositories. If you have access to the NFS server that exposes the NFS share with the release repository, access the top-level directory in the repository. Display the list of files and use the cat command to display the content of the .ovs repo file. The UUID for the Oracle VM Manager is set to none, indicating an unowned repository.